it's Christmas week and family and I are driving through town along Second Road where there's a lot of roadworks at the moment to get to Terminal 21. There's a funfair festival or something that looks entertaining for the kids. And I thought I'd um, show you just how much traffic there is and also talk about just how bad the driving is in Thailand. It's something that I've had to adjust to over the years uh, and do bad things to actually get in line with how you need to drive, such as edging out when you're on a, uh, a side road trying to get onto the main road. Yes, you do it and cars will give way, but there's a few other codes of conduct that are completely different to the Western world. I'm not sure who's the biggest troublemaker. Is it you, Danny, or is it you? I always prefer to be a passenger going through Patia. I can relax a little bit. Okay, here's one thing that I had to learn quickly. If somebody flashes their lights at you as you're driving towards them, it doesn't mean they're giving way to you, which it would do back in the UK or I imagine everywhere else across the world. It means they're coming through and they're not slowing down and they won't slow down. Um, something else that doesn't happen as well is I always remember in the UK, you would wave and say thank you to people. There is no, none of that. I've got, I, it's, it's strange actually what happens to tyres. They're some of the most placid people and fun loving people you can find, yet when they get behind the wheel, they turn into monsters quite often. And the standard of driving is atrocious. It's so easy to pass your driving test here that you probably need, what, a couple of lessons? I don't even know if they get that. A few questions and they're allowed on the road. Unbelievable, really. We're just waiting on the crossroads from Patia South to Second Road in the direction of um, the, the Avenue Shopping Centre. You can see the taxi there, full up, weighed down with people. This is where everyone waits to get on their song towels to take them towards Pratt and John TM. This is Second Road. There's been roadworks uh, for months down here as they've been digging the road up and improving the drainage. It means that you've got all these cars here that are parked uncharacteristically at an angle. What is nice to see is both on Second Road and on Tepeset, they're starting to put tarmac down because previously we had to drive around on concrete roads. If you're familiar with the Thai roads, you'll probably not be surprised to hear that Thailand's got some of the most dangerous roads with the most fatalities every year. I think it's something only like war-torn Syria that has it worse. And it's mainly the motorcyclists because there are hundreds weaving in and out of these roads in amongst cars. And another thing to be aware of, and foreigners get it wrong, they often think that um, the tyre police side with tyres when there's accidents. It's not true. It's all about the size of the vehicle. It's happened to me as well. If you have an accident and you're in a bigger car and you hit a motorbike or a smaller car, then there will be some reasonable doubt to say that you need to be more careful driving that car because it's bigger and you'll tend to find that they'll split the insurance claim even if it was the motorcyclist that drove into you. Had it myself, I was pretty much stationary. Motorbike driver, no lights, in the dark, drove into me and the police said I had the bigger car and I had to stay careful. That's it, that's the rule. Uh, over the years as well, people have started to wear their crash helmets because the police have enforced it but I noticed during Christmas period here it's notably more slack with people including foreigners who should know better not wearing crash helmets Can you ask a window? Okay, I'm going to wrap out there we're not far from Terminal 21 now Traffic's not been as bad as I suspected. That's why I've done this vlog to kill a bit of time. Because you've got the Patty Countdown Festival at the moment and they even blocked some roads off up around Pratt and Act, which made it a nightmare. But for now, keep safe. Down about Thailand.